I think seems good. I got all my stripes in this motherfucker, so just call me Colonel Cash out. You niggas like that. Let me show you how I'm coming. I'm better known as Hoodstock. If you don't know me from the hood, check me out on Worldstock. Shout out to my shooting guard. Yeah, he a shoot. If we catch. Greetings, never quitters. Welcome back to another video. And today, hold on. And today, um, I don't know exactly what we're gonna be talking about, but I, you know, once again, I had to say it. I turn on the camera when I feel inspired. Now I'm gonna start making videos just to make videos, cause I have a lot of topics that's like just written down. Like I got hella topics. I got a lot of topics to talk about. Uh, why you should never make people laugh. Um, or why you should never try to make people laugh. There we go. Never try to impress people. Always be yourself, duh. I got I got so many different video ideas. And I get different type of videos. I got vlogs, I got different ideas, you know, stuff I'm gonna do eventually, but uh, vlogs, outdoor camping videos, mug bangs, collab videos. I got so many ideas. I got so many type of videos written down already. So I can post video pretty much whenever I want to. And I got all different type. I got topics, basically what I'm trying to say is I got topics on deck. I already got hella topics that I already know that I want to talk about. Um, the importance of self-love. I got, I got so many topics. Love you, baby. So, I'm bae. I'm my own bae. It's John. It's bae. My baby. Love you, baby. But yeah. Love myself to the end and beyond. But yeah, uh, I don't know. I just want to talk real quick and, um, you know, make a video. Because that's what I do, man. But, uh, you know. I was just talking about how I'm doing my own thing and how I'm doing the right thing. You know what? Let's talk about what I was talking about. Let's 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 do it. Well, let's do this. In Tamara voice. Okay, sweetie. Well, let's do this. I know what I'm talking about. But anyways, now nah, shout out to you, Tamara. Though. They my one two one of my some of my favorite celebrities ever. They and they got beautiful souls too. They got they live in the righteous way just like me. I, I see their morals and values. See that? Well, I need me need you need me a tear specifically. Tamara good too, but it, man. You ain't gonna find you a Tia in 2021. You not. I'm sorry. You not. It ain't. It ain't. They don't build. They don't make them like how they used to no more. They don't make them like Tia no more. Tia is. I know I'm sounding a little fanboyish, but no Tia is so fucking sexy. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not talking about physical look. I mean, yeah. Oh boy, she bad boy. I'm just, hey, hey, you better watch out, Corey. I tear that thing up. Nah, listen. Nah, I'm not even just talking about looks. I'm talking about her her mindset, how she carry herself. That's even more sexy. Like. Damn, you look good, and you carry yourself this way. Damn, I'm gonna marry you. You know, you know, like that's that's type of girls you want to be qualified for. And that's another thing, y'all gotta start qualifying these girls. And you too, ladies. I mean, obviously, I know y'all do. But just being honest, you know, it's well, this is it's pro female. The world is pro female right now. It was gonna be pro female for a long time. Shout out all the females. Shout out the beautiful, beautiful females. That actually went through a lot of stuff and made themselves great. Shout out to y'all. But it's a lot of females that's just skating by with just their looks. Because they look good. They got rich niggas taking care of them. All type of shit. But shout out to all the real females that's actually been single mothers. That's doing all this real shit. Y'all y'all some real ones. I love y'all. But it's some, like I said, it's a lot of females that ain't doing that shit neither. But anyways, getting back to the point. You know, of me mentioning Tia and stuff. Like I said, they don't make them like Tia no more. Tia is fucking gorgeous. Inside and out. And that's what you need to be looking for, fellas. Like I said, qualify her on more than just her ass. When you meet a girl, <laughs> seriously, I just said, I know I sound like an old hillbilly when I said that, but no, seriously, when you meet a girl, stop just looking at her ass. Stop looking at her butt. Look at her face, damn. You looking at her butt, she might have a damn knife in her face. You wouldn't even notice because you looking at her fucking butt. Relax, dude. You're over this over sexual ass society. Start qualifying on more than how she looks she has to actually bring shit to the table she has to actually have a good piece of mind she gotta actually be striving towards reaching goals in the future she gotta actually be um you know spreading positivity being a positive person doing positive things self-developing leveling up <laughs> into self-help she gotta be she gotta list all qualities at least for me i don't know about you but i'm i <laughs> i qualify all right so and that's not just with females, with anybody. Anybody that's around your life, you gotta qualify them. Don't just be with nobody out of loneliness. That's what a lot of people do. 
And I ain't and I ain't trying to say no names, but it's a lot of people in my family I seen do that. They 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 with these people, they they husbands, wives, they together, but they doing it because they don't want to be alone. That's the stupidest shit you can do. You don't be with nobody because you don't want to be alone. You just be alone until you find a person that's right for you. The hell? Man, people don't get it, man. People and that's why if you watching this and you always been like known as a person who can stay by themselves for a long time and you'll be perfectly fine. You you are you the goat. I need you to know that. Especially girls. And I'm not trying to be sexist feminist and I'm not trying to be sexist and none of this. I'm being dead ass serious. Especially girls. That's just how they brain work. Most girls cannot be alone. They can't. They fucking go crazy. Oh, especially these in these Instagram models, these social media influencers, these TikTok dancers, all these all these girls with you know a lot of people following on following them on their platforms. They boy, let let them be by themselves. They ass gonna go crazy. They need that constant validation and attention to feed their ego, man. So when they don't get it, they gonna be tweaking. What's going on? They gonna they ass gonna be tweaking because they're not used to being alone. I am. I know what it's like. And yeah, yeah, you know, it'd be a lot of times it ain't fun. But but on the contrary, contrary, people think. On the outside looking in, they think being alone, lonely, or being by yourself, I ain't gonna say lonely, that's the wrong word, but they, they think being alone or being by yourself is super depressing, but it's actually not. Most times, it's actually very peaceful. Because, bitch, I ain't gotta deal with none of your fucking weird ass energy. I ain't gotta, you ain't, you ain't distracting to me. I can actually focus on what I need to focus on without you getting in the way. And that's the beauty of being alone. Now, I'm not saying be a lonely, weird old creep hermit, never leave the house and don't. Talk to nobody. No, don't do that shit. Your ass gonna end up depressed. Don't do that shit. But if you find yourself naturally gravitates towards doing things on your own and being self-sufficient, but you still know how to talk to people and you can hang out with people from time to time, then do that, boy. That is that's golden. That's the that's the way to do it, bro. I don't need no people around me. It's, I love once again. I love I love all the people that's for me, that fuck with me, that will actually you know. That care about my well-being. I fuck with all the people in my life like that. Don't get me fucked up. So if y'all watching this, I love y'all. But I just prefer to do it solo dolo. You know, a lot of times. Cause it's it's my I like that. It, it it's it's why I can get a lot of stuff done. Cause like I just explained. No distraction. I don't have to constantly worry about what type of drama you're in because you're not even around me to have the drama. You know, I'm not I'm, you're not even around me for me to see the drama. And there, there is no drama because I don't even see that shit. You feel what I'm saying? That's the beauty of being alone. You able to get things done fast. You able to think. You actually you you able to actually sit with yourself and reflect on what you want to do with your life, man. For real, this is some real shit, man. Coming to you raw and not cutting some shit. Hey, most people ain't gonna tell you, bro. Your daddy ain't gonna tell you. Your family. Most people ain't gonna tell you this shit, bro. But bro, there's nothing wrong with doing it by yourself bro myself is my best friend all i got this is my fucking baby i love myself i'm madly in love with myself this is my nigga this is my this is the love of my life this and my dreams myself and my dreams and god myself and my dreams though that's them the loves of my life so that's always gonna be my first love you know compared to any girl like once again i'm not gonna really discuss my personal day life out of that's just you you won't know if i'm dating somebody or not none of your business but i know and that's all that matters. But, you know, that, that's my first love before any woman, before anybody. That's my first love. Never put a girl above yourself. Remember that. She's always lesser. My dreams are number one. I do anything. I adapt for my dreams. Yes, that says I adapt for my dreams. Because that's how it is. Ow! Fucking wolf, boy. That shit is serious, bro. But seriously, though, you gotta, you gotta really be like that, bro. This shit is weird. You gotta put your dreams number one, and you gotta be able to be different from the crowd. You ain't gotta fit in with no fucking crowd, man. You can stand out, do your own fucking thing. I ain't gotta be with nobody, but I, but I can still hang around people, cause that's just how I am. I'm a rit, I'm a lit, masculine, dominant, alpha ass nigga. Cause I know how to do this shit. And I don't even like calling myself alpha, beta, red pill, none of that shit. I, I'm just a real nigga. So I got the, you know, mentalities and the behavior like one. But I don't identify as one. Fuck you, man. I don't got to call myself alpha male. I don't got to call myself red pill. None of that shit. I'm John. And I'm just lit. I'm naturally that and beyond. It goes beyond alpha and red pill. There's some real nigga shit, bro. But yeah, man.
No man, you can always do it by yourself. No, no, don't ever believe nobody and they like, oh, you, you need friends to be happy. No, the fuck you don't. <laughs> I'm by myself right now. I got friends, but who in the room with me right now? Who, who ain't, who, nobody. I don't need to be around nobody to for me to feel good about myself, for me to feel like I'm enough. I know I'm enough in the inside because I'm, I built myself to be enough and I'm still building myself to be enough to this day. And I know what comes first. I know how to set my priorities straight. I know what priorities come first. I know who's the most important thing in my life. Who's the most important thing to me in my life. I know what's the most important thing to me in my life. I know all that. Cause I set myself and I was able to come to that conclusion. And you can too, as long as you never give up. That's why I always preach that. The entire actions and everything in my life is based off the backbone principle to never give up. And that's how I will continue to live for the rest of my life. Man, that's all it is to it, man. You don't need nobody. You, you can be fulfilling on your own. And guess what? And sooner or later, you're gonna attract somebody just like you y'all gonna be best friends because y'all think alike and you don't need them and they don't need you but y'all glad to have each other y'all fucking lies that's some real they don't get no realer than that man you find your little lady you find your man you find your significant other y'all go through life together you find your best friends you find your real friends if you ain't got friends right now you just because they they waiting on you your people is waiting on you you just gotta attract them you gotta have the right type of energy to attract these people in your life and once you do they gonna come in your life and they gonna stay Cause why not? Y'all both built the same. Y'all got the same mindset. Y'all gonna be together. That's just how it works, bro. So don't feel discouraged if you're alone. You always got me. And most importantly, before anything, you always got yourself. Remember that. Nobody's gonna love John like how I love me. It's not. It's no love in this world that could come close to that type of love that I have for myself. Nothing. Because I am the greatest, and I love myself, and I am the best, and I I, I love myself so much. It's beautiful. But yeah, man, that's all I gotta say. That's my message. You know. Remember, that's just how it has to go. So stay positive, have a good day, and never give up.